Hey up and welcome to Callum's Corner. Now midnight's come and gone. I can't claim it's a shock. I guess I've been resigned to it for the last half hour, 40 minutes. You know, it's not going to happen. Think I haven't get in contact with me at all. You know, kind of started to think you've lost this one. And that's a very new feeling for me. I'm not quite sure what I'm going to do now. To be honest with you, I'm either I'm going to go to sleep. I'm going to sleep on it because that's sensible. And I'm either going to wake up with the fire and the fury in me, or I don't know. But I've written some words. I'm feeling quite a lot of sadness now. You know, I just didn't want to get to this situation. I so hoped something would happen, but I've written some words. Kind of, they're quite they're not dark, kind of melancholy, I guess. And I don't want you to worry. You know, it's not a cry for help. I'm just experiencing the feelings and emoting them it is it's a healthy way to do, deal with it anyway here you go all around me are familiar faces worn out places worn out faces bright and early for their daily races going nowhere going nowhere and their tears are filling up their glasses no expression, no expression. Hide my head, I want to drown my sorrows. No tomorrow, no tomorrow. And I find it kind of funny, I find it kind of sad. The dreams in which I'm dying are the best I've ever had. I find it hard to tell you. I find it hard to take. When people run in circles, it's a very, very mad world. Mad world. Mad world. There's actually a few more verses that I wrote down. It's all popped into my head, but I won't. It's quite melancholy, as I said. I won't bore you with it. I don't know. I don't know. I'm going to go to bed. I don't know what I'm going to do. I do kind of, part of me feels, I don't know, maybe I've said all I've got to say now.